Oh my god, here we are, X-Fire. Are you excited? Uh, yes. You don't oh. sound excited. <laughs> oh, 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 check. I'm learning how to cast it. Oh my god. Well, hello, boys and girls and everything in between. My name is Kazan Moon. Today we're playing some more little goody two shoes. And we're here with X Par 17. I'm not sure if he's gonna be here for the whole stream, because he wasn't last time. But we'll see, because I just finished doing a stream before, so this one will not be that long. What are where are we doing right now? We're um we gotta head to Kieferberg. Was there anything else we had to do? Cause it was like it's been like was it a few days since I've done a little goody two shoes? Like four days? I don't, I don't know. Can I go inside the house? But didn't I just leave the house? I think. Cause I don't think I need to go back in here. I think I'm pretty fine. Now there's little nice flock. Hi flock. You know how to scare me. Yeah, talking to a goat. No, I think. Yeah. Yeah, Rosmarine. This is Rosmarine. This is the Rosmarine I know. There's no doubt about it. Yeah, we just got finished talking to. Um, when I was when I got off, I finished talking to Rosemary. There we go. Can I go inside? Mm. Okay, I'm forgetting how patrols work. I forget I gotta press space bar. It's very about vital parts. I've been playing this game a while. Yep, this thing, the sixth stream. Wait, what's, what's, which number is this? This is the sixth. Yeah, this is the sixth stream for this. And I'm pretty sure there's more to come because there's. We're still only technically at the. His. We only technically just got the first uh, gift for the person in the woodlands, apparently. So. We're working on yeah, this right. We learned about the person in the woodlands, like Yeah, we're still learning about him. So I probably start running. So we're still learning about him and doing stuff. So. Yeah, we have a lot of stuff to go through. And I definitely don't think this will be the last playthrough I ever do of Little Bitty Two Shoes because it's an amazing game and I definitely want to play more. Oh, Rosemary. Oh, the crows are back. Hmm. If you don't know, Xpar, we had a um, bit of a run in with crows last stream because you weren't there, but there's a lot of problem with crows, basically. Just let's put it like that. And now we have a huge no phobia crows. of them. There are no crows. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's so many crows. What is this? What are these crows doing here? I feel oh. alright, Elise. Elise, is everything alright? No, everything's not alright. These crows. This can't be good. I best hurry. Well, let's get out of here. These crows are nuisances. Get out of here, crows! Can I talk to them? Or is this me talking to the sign? No, this is me talking to the sign. That's my, my bad. We were able to talk to the crows before. So, you know. Now it's a little different. <laughs> the crows are everywhere. Ooh, what is this? <gasps> they give us acorns. Oh my god. Because I'm like... I was at depth. Do was it how? How good is me right now? How good am I? How do I check my inventory? Here we go. I was at death's door yesterday. So I'm good right now, I believe, because I ate a lot of stuff. Also, have this really hearty stew that will help us. Hearty soup, not stew. That will help me get out of a pinch uh, later. Um, but I think that's really, that's all I really got in here. I don't know what Muffy needs. Muffy, do we give her a, I think we need to give her a cookie, right? It gives, it gives like a pretzel or a cookie. I'm not sure if I gave her the cookie or if this is the cookie that we're supposed to eat. I'm not sure, but I'm not going to keep it just in case because I am not entirely sure. The crows are everywhere. Oh my god. How much money do I have exactly? I can't tell right now, so let me just go to the shop. <laughs> Hi, Granny Gretel. I have a bit of money. I don't think I'll buy anything. Since I don't... I'm not exactly sure what I need right now. I won't buy anything. Oh, I'm getting stuck. Yeah, but the crows are constantly everywhere. Oh my god. 
Maybe those people will see now that I'm not crazy. These crows are just everywhere. Mm -hmm. Like I told them there were crows there. I thought there was crows here. They wouldn't believe me. I'm not insane. Does no one find this suspicious? Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. <laughs> What's all yes, this? Yes. I don't think I've ever seen so many crows at once. Come, Rosemary, we must find out what's going on. Just a nice good old gathering of crows. I do have one suspicion right now because Rosemary, I'm supposedly supposed to take her on um, my jobs with me so she gets out of trouble, just in case, but you know, that's very expensive and I'm very poor. Mm -hmm. We'll be scrapping bird's poop off the roofs for weeks, Elma. Oh, Elise, would you take a look at, at this nonsense? These crows, I see. A lot of people work is thick with this filthy things. I told everyone I'd seen them yesterday, Miss Elma. They're a pest and Lord knows where they've come from. Oh, but they're not dangerous, I'm certain. What are you saying, lass? Of course they are. Oh, I forget these are the mean girls. These are the um, old witches of the West. I just love to... What's it? Witches is oh. a strong word. Yeah, I'm sure saying witches. They're winches, is what they are. Mm. Terrible people mm. that just love throwing mud in my name. Mm -hmm. Best, uh, you best talk some sense in your cousin Elsa. Uh, I'll say Elsa. <laughs> okay, Elias. She's clearly not all there. The poor lass. All right, let's go, Rosemary. Talking to these two fools. Hmm. Should never. Should never. Let me just move my bed. Where are we going now? Let's... Anyone down here? The crows are certainly everywhere. That's for certain. No, let me move my mic a little just bit. Just for it's... you. <laughs> what? Maybe you're one of the crows. I have a crow like eye print in her eye, in her eye for some reason. I don't know. It's like a marking. See, she is a crow. I wanna go as far as to say that. Well, you can move my mic. And they're just looking for her family. They're just going to go take her back. Okay, is that is that good, X-ray? I'm still good right there. I I feel like I am. I mean, I'm, you don't notice I any difference. You don't notice any difference. That's good then. Yeah, no. no. Okay, this crow is everywhere, oh my god. Why are there rotten tomatoes here? These smell awful. They're also Many your blemish friend. to what? They're also your friend when they're red like you. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Okay. Discolored and wrinkled apples await to be fed to the livestock. Oh, they really are taking- hold up. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. I might not be the smartest person, but, um... This symbol is definitely looking all too familiar. This is the symbol yeah, that's- no, I think you're going crazy. This is the symbol that's on top of the wall in the cabin where we saw that strange monster. Why is it here? What does that symbol even mean? That's like the real question. I'll go to the well since we haven't like been over there. We'll see. Okay, there's nothing over here, so I think that's fine. Um, I think I have to go this direction over here. This should be good. Oh, people, hello. No use whining about it, Jacob. It's it's n it's a no. But Granny, what's wrong, Miss Marilyn? It's Alf, lass. He came down with a fever last night. A fever? Is he all right? Leb said the poor lad was delirious. Oh please, let me go and see him, Granny. See who? Absolutely not, Jacob. And that's final. Where is he Are right now? Sick? Hmm? 
The person who's sick, that's what they're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Wants to go see Jacob, his uh, little boy's friend. Uh, Leia's here right now, Miss Marilyn. And Charge have heard. Oh, I could go with, uh, wait for him by the fountain. Wait for your father to come back, Jacob. I wouldn't want you at these birds' mercy either. But Granny, this also goes for you too. Don't go near those crows, you hear. Oh, but have they hurt anyone? Lord knows they could. She is making some good points, even though these crows are very <laughs> annoying and vicious. They haven't hurt anyone yet. So I'd assume they start hurting people. I mean, I think it's a natural, what is it? Um, instinct to kind of be afraid of giant groups of anything, really. Because if you see a giant group of crows or birds, and they actually did want to attack you, you'll be in a very bad way. Let's just put it like that. Hello, you two. Okay. I should have believed you last night, Elise. Oh, you should believe me now? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm. Okay. You want to believe me now, but last night you were surely just accusing me. I wasn't sure. No, it wasn't you. It was Lorelei. The lady sitting right there with the basket in her hand. I remember you. I might have not played this game for a few days, but I remember it all. Yeah, you should have believed me. I suppose. Not that it would have prevented anything, though. Oh, the dreadful things are everywhere, but you're not going really to apologize, are you, Lorelei? Call me a liar, huh? Yep. They've been circling the windmill all morning, you see. The lads are still up there trying to do away with them. Circling the windmill? What for? Why to still our grains, at least? Those crows are, are, are a bad omen, that's for sure. I wouldn't want to lend old Josh's notion any weight, but... We should give it some thought, I'd say. Lorelei, you used to be smart. And now you seem a little... I'm not gonna say the words, but you're not gonna be in my good books anymore. Let's put it like that. Now that's a bad omen. Well, technically, crows have been said, seen as, what is it? The death, the death. Okay, this, probably, this is an event, so I probably should is not. No. Uh, messengers of death. There you go. Mm, I, mm, I've never heard that. that. That's that's what they are, usually. If I'm not wrong. Usually they're yeah, like... Well, vultures are actually a messenger of death. I like mean, death. crows are also like vultures as well. They, they, they do not eat dead things. Crows do as well. They will eat seeds. You mean crows do as well? As if they see seeds. That's yeah, why I'm saying that they don't vultures don't eat seeds. They eat whatever is a dead. Yeah, but I'm just telling you from the what crows were like. Why do you think a whole group of crows are called a murder? It's not just called a murder for no reason. I, I, hmm. We've heard very different things. What, what do you mean? I've never heard it. I've never some heard somebody say, "Oh, there's a group of crows." Did you know they're also called a murder? I've never heard that. That that is the correct uh, term. That is what um, they're called. Crows are known for. Okay, cool. Okay, I feel like you're having. To, okay, okay, I feel like you know what? You could check. It's it's if you want to fact check. It's it's you could do it, but have Crows some faith are in me. Crows known for their intelligence and Jesus. adaptability. Jesus. Uh, I best go lend the lads a hand, Brunhild. No, I don't want to say his name. Please don't go. What's going on here? You don't mean to say you haven't seen them, do you? I've seen them before. Anyone else in Kieferberg, as you know. Now you got to know something about this then. Mm, Wilma, just my favorite person, aren't you? Oh, please, stop with that nonsense, Miss Wilma. Those wretched things broke into the windmill, at least. Hence why I'd best head back there, Brunhild. She's pregnant. Guda. I'll call him, I'll call him Gu, Gu, Guda. Gudu. Gudu? <laughs> I'll call him Gu. I'll call him Gu. That's what I'm gonna call him. She's pregnant, Gu. 
Don't let her get worked up. They broke into the windmill, Miss Boo? Mr. Goo? Stolark reigns the bastards. I must go, Brunhild. I can't stand here all day. Oh, Goo. What if they attack me while you're away? Then go inside the house. They're not gonna break down the windows, I would hope. <laughs> That'd be quite a, a scene, I would say, but I don't truly believe that they would break down the windows. So did you find any information, Xpar? The only information that I found is what are crows known for, uh, for their intelligence and adaptability. Well, you gotta probably search what are a group of crows called. Well, yeah. I, and I, then also I probably, we probably should look up what are crows, um, depiction and mythology often, uh, that would probably very specific things. I'm just telling you the truth I mean there's a reason there's a reason why so many shows like you see just a burial of dead bodies or something like a war happened and then you'll mm -hmm. see tons of crows circling the area and picking at dead bodies yeah, and I'm, I'm, not, I'm not saying that I don't think you're correct. I just think that... Just think why? I just don't think that... What's it called? That... Nobody that I've heard of has ever called a good because of murder before. That's all. <laughs> uh, all I will say is I didn't know this. Before, until I was told this before. With a long history of fear and loathing. Ah, mm, I'm. Oh, yeah. Keep going. That loathing is not that. Keep going. That is just being annoyed. Keep going. That that that's all it says. That, but you and considered a pest by farmers. That's that's literally all it says. Well, you know what? It doesn't matter. Anyone who watches the video, put in the comments. What do you know about crows? That's all I'll ask of you. Even if you don't like this video, okay. or if you say it's terrible, horrible, but put in facts okay. that you know about crows and true facts. So I, I need okay. to feel some, I need people to know that I'm not crazy. Okay. 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 That I am, in fact, right. Because x knows this out of anything in the world. Go play your game. You know, you know, play anything in the world. You know what? I love being more go, than anything else. And that's being right. As long as I'm right, nothing else matters. I could be dying right game. now. I could be shot in the forehead. But as long as I'm right, <laughs> everything is fine. Go play your game. <laughs> go play your game, little, little guy. Let's go play your game. Okay, play okay. I'm just it. saying. I'm just saying. Um, I'll take yeah, good yeah, care go of it, Father. <laughs> There's nothing to see here, at least. You best head back to town. Whoa, what's the hostility? Not really hostility, but why can't I be here? Probably because all of only the, the guys are here. She's not one of the guys, no one of the, the fellas, one of the blokes. You were the one who first saw these crows, weren't you, Elise? Mm hmm And no one believed me, and you all said I was liars? Yeah, you want to burn me at a stake? Mm hmm It's not as though you folks believed me when I when it mattered. I've said it last night, and I'll say it again. You're hiding. He's still talking nonsense. They won't let him. They don't want to shut him up. It matters not, old Joshi. We must focus on the matter at hand. We all had our uh, fill of trouble last night, didn't we? We need not any more. Yeah, we don't need any more yelling. That's for certain. <sighs> Now, that didn't still they didn't steal that much grain, folks. You know, How much I... did they steal, Mr. Gustav? About a sack in total. We got here in time to prevent the worst. The darn birds were building a nest in the oven. We ought to give it a good scrubbing later. It doesn't seem they're keen on attacking at least. We've locked it up and trusted Eugene here with the key for now. I appreciate I appreciate the trust. Of course, especially after all of yesterday's ongoing going ons. 
because he was stolen from or because he has no horse to steal the grain with. <laughs> interesting, that, that is an interesting thing to think. Um, who's to stand guard here then? Before we get into that, Barnhard, there's something I'd like to say. We all, we're all aware of what happened last night, however, we ought to stick together, folks, now more than ever. You heard the man. <laughs> Gufenberg is what, is what we make of it. Don't forget that. I love Gustav. He's such, such a upbeat up man. He's so good. There's a reason Freya is so good like, like him. Like father, like daughter. I ought to, um, head back to the church. Yeah, you go back to the church. No one likes you here. Specifically, I don't like you because you're, you're mean. Is Alf mm. feeling better, Father? Mm. That's what I'm looking into, Finn. Mm. You best go with Elise. Leb will fill you in, I'm certain. Will do, Mr. Gustav. Did that take time for me? No, okay, it actually didn't take time for me. It was just mm. me, um going through a vent. I was wondering, Elise. Mr. Barnhart said the crows weren't were trying to still make a nest in the oven. I suppose it's a cozy little nook. I don't see what's so So there's an oven in the windmill, right? There's always mm. been an oven in the windmill, Rosemary. What's your the tender flesh, Elise? Oh, oh, oh. So I have to use the oven to prepare the tender flesh. Ah! Okay. Wouldn't this be a good way to prepare it? Making bread of it, you say? Maybe you could also ask about about town if they'd let you in. That's rather risky. After what's been happening, I'm pretty sure they'll be like, you're working with the crows. Old Joshin is already spouting nonsense about Elise. Well, he says she's hiding something. Not wrong, technically, in that fact. I suppose, but I can't think of any other way, way either. If Not if I want to find him. It's worth a try, I'd say. Alright, I'll see what I can find out. Okay, let's see what we can do. Right, a little suspicion. Hello, fellas. How how's how things going on here? I say they snuck in through the roof, Gustav. When did you realize the crows were in the windmill, Mr. Ludwig? Henrich came about to collect some flour this morning. He was the one who gave the alert. So you locked it up? Have you? Must keep those birds out, Elise, or they'll take all our grain. You could draw them away. Are you standing here all day? I would say you could draw them away, because that might be the better solution. Maybe if you scattered some grain elsewhere, Mr. Gustav, then the windmill would still be available, and... We've thought about that, at least. Nobody was in favor of wasting any more grain, lass. Ah, I see. You ought to keep a close eye on the windmill, at least. You could find... You could have a word with Eugene, uh... Perhaps. No, of course. Okay, so I talked to Elizabeth. Talk to you people again. Suppose they'll be guarding it all day. Let's have a word with you, Mr. Eugene. Okay. So I didn't look down the other place to see what everything was down there. Is there anything down here? Uh, no, there is not a single thing down here. Okay. Good to know. Hello, peoples. Oh, it's Wilhelm. Better days will come, lad. When I'm settled in Prendorf, good uh, God willing. Don't make these hasty decisions, Eugene. What is it, you, uh, Elise? You're rather trusted, Miss Eugene. I was wondering about the key. 
Okay, maybe we shouldn't pick the one that's gonna sound like we're just trying to get the key. <laughs> I feel like that would be um, a bit suspicious, but you know. With the key to the windmill, even, the last is right, Eugene. It's a shame for you to leave. Nothing I can do about that, folks. There's nothing left for me here in Keeperberg, you see. Still, I think think everyone would miss you, miss you, Mr. Eugene. Please reconsider. No, I've made up my mind, but I do appreciate it, at least. Even this key, I will only be holding on to it until the evening. Until the evening, Mr. Eugene? It's too much it's too much responsibility, alas. I'm not too comfortable with it in my pocket, I must admit. Why not hand it over to someone else then? I could take it to Mr. Gustav if you'd like. That's alright, uh, Elise. There's no better place than Kieferberg, lad. Okay, so I asked Eugene about the key. So, how do I get the key? Talk to Elizabeth in the church. Okay, I did that. Investigate the note further. Okay. Well, I talked to you two. Are you up for more talking? No. They've already talked to them as good as we can. Okay, let's leave. I need to go to the church. Let's leave. Mm -hmm. Let's go here. There's not much to do. I've already talked to everyone, kind of. Unless there's more people out here now, because half the guys are out and about. Mm -hmm. Are they out here? Just gonna make sure I cover all grounds. I wanna talk to everybody. Everyone must talk to Elise. Everyone. Break down the doors to go talk to them. Mm -hmm. Let's go to the church. Hello? Oh, it's an event. Hello! Ah, it's nice to see you, Elise. You've heard about Alf, I assume. No, I haven't. Alf was very ill last night, Elise. He had a, a very high fever. He was delirious. Oh, the poor lad. I can't bear looking at his little hands. What about them, Miss Dorothea? Is it Dorothea or Dortha? Dor no, it's Dorothea. Dorothy. It's best... Dorothy? Is it Dorothy? No. <laughs> so mess up with... Mess up me up, I explore. It's best you hear from me, Elise. So you get the real story. Okay. You've been up... Uh, you've been up all night, Elizabeth. We can tell her. Alf is fine now, as you can see, but last night, he... I was awoken by him moaning, speaking nonsense. Oh my. His fever was boiling him alive. I... We all called for Father Hans and brought him to the church, but... Alf had never been so ill, I thought I'd lose him. Oh no. He wasn't all there either kept mumbling to himself and I I don't know how but his hands are injured it's horrifying and they were so bloody it's as if they were pecked by something I can't explain it okay if you say pecked then see the crows all around the place maybe maybe there's a correlation there <laughs> I don't know just maybe <sighs> please, um, please collect yourself, Miss Elizabeth. <sighs> That's right, Miss Elizabeth. Take a deep, take deep breaths. At first, I thought he'd caught the goat's sickness somehow, but it doesn't explain his hands or what happened to my goats. Oh, she's crying. She's breaking down in tears. Oh my god. I mean, all the terrible things are happening with her. I think anyone would break down in tears. I mean, imagine your child just immediately getting in pain for no reason. True. Also, her business is basically going out of business, so no money to feed the children, so... Yep. 
So that's just when she's getting rid of the milk. Mmm. Okay. People think I say unhinged things. What? You do. I, I do. Say it and it's not. It's not. It's not. What's it called? It's not expected of me. Cause I don't. Oh. Okay. Everybody just said, "Get rid of children." Let that be known. So when I say the next yeah, unhinged thing. Yeah, I said thing, that one thing, and you say unhinged things all the time. I don't know. Oh, okay. So that makes it better then. I don't get on your. I don't get on your back for these kind of. Things. Yes, you do. <laughs> I do it sometimes, but not all the time. It's mostly super. Mm, true. Mm. Okay, we're gonna drop past this before the thing is messy. I might say some more mm-hmm. unhinged things here. Oh, this is mm. this is my disgrace. It's all right, Miss Elizabeth. We're all here for you. It's all right. You know, I. What about the goats? You must have had. Oh my! Can I put this on YouTube? It must have happened while we were praying for Alf in church. When Miss Elizabeth went to fetch him um, dry clothes, she she happened to, upon two of her goats lying on the ground. They bled to death. Their tongues had been ripped out and, oh my god, their heads were severed too. Oh my. Mm-hmm. This is not something that just casually happens. <laughs> you can rest assured we'll help you, Miss Elizabeth. Yeah, I need to do a little. I need some more. I need to do a little bit more than help him because that's some pretty wild things happening. Because this happened in the span of like a few hours too. This is. Oh, okay. My child's having a, a terrible fever. Gotta go back home and get stuff. Oh, look at my gold swamp. Oh, they're playing on the grass, severed heads and tongues ripped out. <laughs> Just them playing around being silly. <laughs> That's pretty wild someone did that so quickly too. I shall arrange for a doctor to come as soon as possible. What am I to do with one sick goat, father? We'll make certain you and your children don't go without Miss Elizabeth. You're welcome to have supper with Finn and I anytime, Elizabeth. Thank you, but I don't have the strength, Dorothea. Miss mm. Dorothea will be looking after Alf, Miss Elizabeth. You best go home and rest for the day. I don't think I want to go back to my home. <laughs> of course, Father. Thank you. Oh. Come, I'll walk you. I'll walk with you and Alf phone. I'm sorry, I. This is awful, Elise. I have to pray, pay them a visit later. This is awful. Oh my god. Terrible. It's one thing after another, isn't it? But first things first. I have to figure out how I'm going to get my hands on that key. Oh, not the sick child or the decapitated ghost with the tongue snatched out. <laughs> okay. I feel like that's the most important thing, but I think it's more of her not... I won't say it's not caring, but it's these people are not so... being so nice to her lately. Mm-hmm. Hello. Is everything all right, Miss Marilla? Mar- Mar- Marilla? Marilyn? Is that what I called her? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Marilyn. Oh, Elise, it's horrifying to think this would happen to Elizabeth, of all people. All of her, all on her own with two young children, too. Oh, I wouldn't know what to do with myself. I haven't seen Gloom all morning. I had a word with Miss Elizabeth early this morning. Rune was in tears. I couldn't bear it to bear the sight. It seems they're going to be in class with Dorothea and Leb. I'll see what I can do for them this afternoon. Even if it's just keeping them company or entertaining room. Oh, I can only hope none of this misfortune gets sent my way. Oh, uh, well, mm. <laughs> well, you know, things happen. Mm. 
Sorry, I had to get my dog. She was at the door scratching. Want to come in? Mm -hmm. Um, anything down here? No. Uh, I think I probably might go in here. Uh, let's see. Oh! Quest! I'll take a quest. Ah, there you are, Elise. You seem troubled, Mr. Ludwig. All of Pipperberg is troubled, lass. Now, can you do me a favor? Um, if you give me some good things, then yes. Bertha, Bertha and I are thinking of spending a week in Primdorf after the festival. I think everyone's thinking of leaving Kieferberg at this point. <laughs> in Tr in Primdorf, Mr. Lulek? My daughter has been ins uh, insisting we visit, you see. Seeing our grandchildren would be good for Bertha too. Why don't you visit more often, Mr. Lulek? Such a long way to uh, Kieferberg. Kieferberg? Primdorf, oh my god. It's really not that far away. If Krimdorf is that castle down the hill, then I think, um, yeah, it's not that far away. We can literally just see it, so. No, it's miles away. I wouldn't, I wouldn't say, yeah, probably a few miles, but it's not that far. You can literally see it. And grab it. They'd have to spend five days and five nights walking. <laughs> oh, it's not that far. No, 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 no. You don't understand. Hmm. Okay, do me a favor, will you, Elise? Go ask Finn if he can look after my cabbage while I'm away. Your cabbage, Mr. Ludwig? They need daily tending, too, and these crows aren't helping. But tell him he can't simply beat them with a hoe, you, you hear? Why would he do such a thing? Young lads are lazy, that's why. I might beat the the cabbage, what the hell, or the birds. The <gasps> oh, I forgot to talk to. Oh, I forgot. Oh, that was my own fault. I forgot to talk to the There was a lady right here. I didn't talk to her. That was me being stupid. What was her name? I forgot her name. The um, other old, Marily? No, not Marily. Um, I, I literally forgot her name. I, I forget. I was supposed to talk to her, and I didn't talk to her. And it's my own fault. Mm -hmm. I just finished talking to you people, so... Wait, is there someone up there I need to talk to? No, I don't think so. Wait, who was I supposed to talk to again? <laughs> I'm not insane. I'm not insane. I've got terrible memories, what it is. Who am I supposed to talk to? Oh... Here's one of the, the mean girls. Oh, can't Saturday come any sooner? This week has brought us nothing but trouble. These crows all about town, too? We ought to have um, believed you yesterday, at least. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter anymore, Miss Arena. All that's keeping me in good spirits is the festival, if I'm honest. You'd heard about Alf, uh, Alf, Elise. The poor boy. I'll ask Miss Elizabeth what I can do for her later. She hasn't had time to look after herself, I wager. Oh, I can't bring myself to smile on days like these. Now, that's truly a shame, I say. You can't say that out uh, here, Elise. Huh? Why not? What? What are you two witting on about now? Oh, it's nothing, Miss Wilma. Doesn't concern you, Miss Wilma. Oof. Elise. Ah. Hey, hey. She's always mean to me, and no one's, no one's helping me out. I defend myself. Keep talking about little people like that. Let me, let me be a little witty at least once. <laughs> I need something. Oh, here's the other two mean girls. Oh, here's Elma. Elmo, really. Oh, I haven't had a proper night's sleep since Friday. You need, you need a lot more than sleep. Elise, uh, here has... Here has been sleeping like an angel, I'd wager. Oh, Elise here has been sleeping like an angel, I'd wager. Oh. Messing with me the first thing in the morning, are you, Miss Bertha? 
My, there's hardly a need to threaten folks like that, at least. Threaten? I promise you, every time I talk to these two, it's always nonsense. How's that a threat, Miss Elna? You can tell us, at least. There's no harm. Oh, it's Audley. There, I was supposed to talk to Audley, but I didn't talk to her. I'm so sad. Now I don't. I won't like know what she was gonna say. Eek! Don't say it. We were the one. We were the only one who knew about these crows. Why is that? Because I'm the witch. Of course, I'm not gonna say that. I'm not an idiot. There's nothing I can say. Miss Bertha. Miss Bertha's taking a liking to teasing us, Miss Audley. I suppose. Truly, Bertha, this isn't the time. Finally, someone's telling Bertha to go fall off a cliff. I didn't say that, but... <laughs> well, telling her to, to, like, shut up. <laughs> Why? Two very different things. That's what, I, that's what I need her to do, really. Why? I'm not teasing anyone. This is a legitimate question. It doesn't matter who saw them first, Bertha. What matters is that they're here, and they're not leaving no matter what we do. This is an omen. That's what it is. Come now, Audley. Let's get you home. My suspicion went down. Oh my god. Thank goodness. Oh my goodness. Thank god. I'm too poor. Okay. Now. Who am I supposed to go find to talk to? Let's find somebody and talk to them. I don't think I need to go to the church. Oh, Lev is here, so talk to her. You look awful, Lev. It's no wonder, is it? I've seen Alf so ill has had me worrying about him all night. Miss Elizabeth said he was mumbling to himself. He was having convulsions, speaking of the witch, too. Sound like he's been listening to too much of old Josh and nonsense, that's what. I think so too. What about Alf's hand? What was that about? I'd say he did that to himself. He was gripping his fist the entire time, so say Lev. If it's about last night, Elise, what else would it be about Lev? I'm worried about you. They gave me a lecture is all. Mr. Gustav was very supportive of me, but Father Hans, he... Oh, that old geezer better not have. Father Hans isn't all there either, at least. We can tell them. What do you mean, isn't all there? Oh, Joshin's very much convinced you saw those crows for a reason, and... Father Hans starting to believe them, I think. Oh, for goodness sake. So you're saying it's Father Hans. It's not so much on our side. Of course I knew he wasn't on our side. But now I really gotta look out for him apparently. Okay. Be careful at least. There's only so much I can do for you. Yep. Yeah. I mean I knew Father Hans would be a problem. I never thought he wouldn't be a problem, but you know. Go. Can I go to the can I go to their house? This, this is their house. Can I talk to them? Who am I supposed to talk to? Because was to help the children, right? Help some children. So who am I trying to find to talk to? I wouldn't say that that's what lazy folks do, but actually what I could literally just do. I don't think it's far enough. You're welcome to have supper with us. I think if I go down enough, Elise, Brunhild, Elise, Brunhild, Ludwig. Okay, there you are. I'll give Grace Trouble Last, da da da. And Primdorf, da da da. Who am I looking for? Why don't you visit more often? Do me a favor. Go ask Finn. Okay, I'm looking for Finn. There you go. Thank God I remember you can. Go back and chat. So where the frick is Finn? Where's this man at? I think he's at the windmill, but it could be a quest that requires you to like, like you know, 
progress the day, then I'll actually be able to find them. But I'm gonna try to go to the windmill just to see if I can find them. Because I don't want to mess this up. Because they can give you some pretty good stuff, I will say. Okay. This is not Finn, that's Eugene and other guy. Oh, oh, they're not here, so I probably might have to progress the day. Actually, maybe not. Gustav? You ought to have believed you last night, Elise. That's all right, Mr. Gustav. I know I, I know it caught folks off guard. It's a burn hard. So I probably need a progress today to find Finn. I do wonder what these crows came from, though. Ah, Elise. I was hoping to have a word about Leb. You owe that last piece of your very soul, Elise. Oh, what do you mean, Gust Mr. Gustav? The poor lass stood up for you against Father Hans and Old Josh all evening. Ah, yes, I know. You'd have been in for a real earful had it not been for her. Leb's a friend to keep Elise. Don't take her for granted. I don't, Mr. Gustav. Of course, I love Leb. She's like the best. She's been keeping. Uh, she's been um, standing up for me. She's been making. Telling people I'm okay, I'm fine, I'm not a witch. Because we need a friend like that. So no one else is like speaking up. Freya is there, but I know her, her personality, so I don't expect her to speak up. But we still love her. But all these other people sit there and watch like bystanders. Oh, Josh and I. He's been rather vocal about these crows, too. Everything will be fine, folks. You'll see. Well, that's good to know. Well, let's probably go and progress the day. So, there's only two things I can do. I'm gonna help with wood chopping or help with chickens. Of course, you know what I'm gonna do. Wood, because I'm not doing chickens. Never again. Okay, mm. hey, I'm assuming you want chickens, and then I'm assuming that it is up here that wants wood. You're assuming that's it? Yep. You don't know? Well, okay, I can look. No, it doesn't tell me who, who what. Okay. Where's the person that's giving me the wood? For the wood? Where are they? Are they out here? I really don't remember where they are. Not out here. Oh my god, half the stream is just me running around the place. Cause I've forgotten where everyone is. I'm sorry, stream. Or future stream people. I have to skip a little bit into the video because I'm trying to find where this, these freaking people are so I can chop this wood. Mm -hmm. I already talked to you. Over here. Is he over here? Here he is. Ah, you're just who I, I needed at least. Is there anything I can help with, Mr. Goo? I don't have time to chop wood for the fireplace today, you see. I'll do it, because of course. Need wood? I'll just chop, because I love chopping wood. That's what I like doing. Will you be on a patrol, Mr. Goo? Standing guard by the windmill, lass. Someone has to keep those wretched crows out of our grain. Ooh, ooh, that's... I, just, I need Rosemary to help me at least one time, so I won't do it now. But I need to get some food first off, because I am... I will be on death's door, because I'll be hungry. So what keys do I need again to chop wood? <laughs> Which keys is it? It's... It is E and R. Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay, I can do this. Get out of here. Got it. Got it. Got it. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Got it. Got it. Got it. Go. Go. Two. 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 
Okay. I want to check at the highest score I can, but I have to go slow. Not slow, but I have to focus, because if not, I'm going to mess up too much. I also need money, too, so messing up is not an option. <laughs> See this chat? This is the man that's cooking chickens away. Man with... At least has iron legs. She has thick thighs, like upper arms with thunder thighs. Thick and anvils apparently too. And whole goats. Look at that. I don't think I got the highest score I can get, but that's me going over fast, but I think I did 52. <gasps> X bar. X bar. Mm -hmm. X bar. X bar. Look at look look at the screen. Yeah. Look at the screen. Look at the screen. I got oh, a, wow. I got an S rank. I got an S rank. That's the best rank ever. Finally. Finally I've done it. I've got an S rank. I, I feel like a lot of games make the highest score not too too difficult to get. But I think they should add S, but I think they should add, add, add like, S+. Plus. Just because I'm being honest, like, a lot of games, like, I'll be like, oh my gosh, it's so bad. And then it gives me, like, A, and I'm like, excuse me? <laughs> that is not fair. I made, I made over no. 10 mistakes. What do you mean I got A? That just means it's pretty easy, then. Oh mm -hmm. my god, I got S, uh, I'm so amazing. Give me all your money. Oh. At a girl, at least. You got some good arms on you. Mm, it's all about the, the legs, Mr. Goo. You gotta kick those ghosts, those chicken, and those anvils. You gotta send them flying. It's all in the legs. The arms don't matter. <laughs> don't skip leg days, kids. Always leg day. Ah, I suppose. Here you go, lass. Oh my god, I'm rich. Oh my god. That gave me. He gave me 60. No, not 60. I had, how much did I have before? I think it gave me like 57? Actually, because I had like 23? Did I have 23? I don't know. I almost assume I had 6. Let's go say, let's say we got 6 from that. Thank you, Mr. Goo. Oh my god, I'm rich. I'm filthy sneaking rich. Oh my god. You know what, Rosemary? I can actually take you on that. On the trips with me now. Because I have money to spare. I have so much money to spare. Oh, everyone's here. I guess I might as well talk to these people since I'm here. Hello. It's been... It's best you start confessing, Dorothea. Well, you know, as soon as I said they said... As soon as I thought they said confessing, I was like, Oh, here we go. They're gonna start saying something about Elise. But actually, it's not Elise. It's Dorothea. A mother's sin passes on to her child, you know. Okay, actually, you know what? Actually, I don't like the situation either. <laughs> I think I'd rather actually be Elise, because I don't feel like she can handle this. Oh, for goodness sake. Because I feel like everyone already hates Elise, so might as well just go down with it. <laughs> Why? It's a fact, Elise. Why you ought to do... What you ought to do, Dorothea, is wear your rosary all nine months. Oh, I will, I will. But Brunhild... She... What about Miss Brunhild? She's been doing these... Divinations? I don't think those work anyhow. Why not let her then? Ha. Huh. I don't... I don't know. Isn't divinations... What are divination? I know what they kind of are. I don't necessarily know what they kind of do. I know they're kind of like, I wouldn't say a ritual, but they're not like sightseeing, sightseeing. Future? Future scene? What is it? Fortune telling. There we go. They're not like fortune telling, but I think they're similar kind of? I don't know. Do you know what divinations are, X-Bar? X? You don't? Okay. No. Uh... I don't think those work anyhow. You know what? Why not let her then? Let's go with that. Miss Brunhild's so anxious. It's might make her settle down a little. Elise. I think you say such a thing, lass. Oh. 
Was that the wrong answer? <laughs> huh? Truly, Elise. This, this is rather dangerous. Whether we believe in the witch or not, she could hurt herself. I don't know what you've been doing behind our backs, Elise, but where's this all coming from? Like, really? I just said, why not let her do it? I have to look at what a divination is because I feel like I was just told, I just told someone to go commit a, a, grand, a grand heinous crime apparently because as soon as I said that, everyone started just jumping on top of me like dog piling. Like, what's going on? All I'm saying is that Miss Brunhild is an adult and as such, Brunhild's rather gullible Elise. We all know that. Well dang, tell it to her face. Oh, you best get Elise away from Brunhild, Dorothea. Why you get my suspicion uh, lit up? Speaking, speaking knowledge from the supernatural means. Mm. I don't. They think we're a witch. Because they said that. Because it's by unknown or unnatural supernatural means. Yep, that would make sense. Oh, this girl. Puppy. It's you. Well, I wish you would have told me that, X-Car. But for... Hey, man, I don't look after No, you have your choice. You could have looked it up. I don't want to do it during stream. Mm -hmm. You could have been like, oh, this is what divination means. You should have just told me, and then I would have been like, yeah, this you is not... You should have asked me. I did ask you. I said, what is it? You, know you said, oh, expert, do you know what this is? And I said, no. And then if you were to look it and up, then... you should have just told me you were to look it up. But you didn't tell me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Whatever. I've already got suspicion up, so it's too late. But I think now that Muffy's here, I'll be able to lower suspicion anyway. That's enough. I'm not giving you one more crumb. Oh, but... but you promised me... Uh, some leb, leb cookies. <laughs> I promised you nothing, Mercy. Here we are, her name changing again. Like always, folks are already already think it's strange, Elise, that you know about the cr crows since you since yesterday. You know, you know what? Why don't you go ahead? Who's to believe a scrawny little squeaker, a squiller? Like you, anyhow. Oh, Josh and does at least. Mrs. Utterly does too. Oh, the two problem makers. You're gonna go to them, okay? Oh, do they? What are you telling? What are you telling them then? <gasps> that I saw you talking to those crows yesterday. Oh, there are. There was a golden one too, wasn't there? Muffy, what are you doing until late at night? Like. What she's saying is all true. Let's not, let's not. Let's make this uh, clear. It's true that this did happen. But why are you spying so hard? This point might as well be a stalker. Puppy. Why you <laughs> following you about town is truly so much fun, Elise. A stalker, stalker behavior. Okay. <laughs> Just a child, and she's already doing some very sus suspicious things. Okay. You can tell we got a. Mm, this one's gonna be in, in jail when well, she's older. I just know you have the lab you promised me tucked away somewhere. I do, is the thing. I do have it. All right. Keep her mouth shut here. I don't want uh, to add any more to these folks' imagination. <laughs> Why, but they're not imagining anything, are they? Oh, shush it! Shut up. Uh, shut it, muddy. <laughs> Her name is Muddy now. X for Muddy Puddle. Uh, Muddy, you can't be saying that. Yeah, Muddy's in this apparently. He's doing great things. No, no. <laughs> She's saying that about Muddy. I'm about to out her to the entire town. <laughs> Shut it, Muddy. Not one more word about this. I'll keep yeah. quiet, but okay. what? Something that right. there we go. Hmm. I'll keep quiet, but I was wondering. I gave you what you wanted, so go away. Alright, but why don't you bring me a hearty stew tomorrow? 
Luckily, I already have one of those, but this lady is getting out of hand. Like, those are expensive. Out with it! Off with you, Mandy. <laughs> My suspicion went down. Thank God. Suppose I'll be safe for today. Hope it's time to talk to these, um... These people. Actually, what do I have for quests? Play with the kids. Oh, no. Play... Kiss the rat with the kids. Help Wilhelm with the chickens. Ooh. I did say I would help the children. Ooh. Ooh, but I don't want to play kiss the rat. Do you know what that is? Kiss the rat? Yeah. Yeah, I played it before. It's me throwing... I'm throwing rats and I'm hitting them with freaking bats. <laughs> That's, that's what it is in this game. If there's a real thing, then I don't know what it is. That's that. No, I would not know. It's a real thing. I, uh, yeah. Don't go losing your wits like that, Audley. It may be best for... Uh, best to rest for the day, Miss um, Audley. Is everything alright? Eek! What's gotten into her? Audley's terrified of the crows, at least. Old Josh is right. It's the lassies and her cousin. Okay, Audily. I know you're a sick individual and you need help and you're old. But this only so just true. You said what? Okay, for some of those things that aren't correct. Okay. It's true. I do feel like she has mm. some kind of mental illness, I'm not gonna lie about that fact. I I'm not, I'm not disagreeing with that, I'm disagreeing with other things. What was the other thing, then? Uh, saying that... Okay, I need to look back on the street, you said something. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I, I'm personally very not tired at all. So I haven't been paying 100% attention. Oh, I know. I'll let you look back while I'm reading this. Oh, for goodness sake. Uh, I'll look at them later. Mm. <laughs> Okay. This isn't good for you, Miss Audley. Think about your health. Your heart can't take any more, much more. You don't have a heart attack. Oh, but I can't settle down, Miss. Uh, I can't even say Miss. I can't settle down merrily. The Lord is with Kieferberg. We must not forget that. You ought to put your faith in him, Miss Audley. That's right, Audley. You can't get swayed by whatever old Joshin says. Do I look like a witch to you, Miss Otterly? Oh, I wouldn't know, lass. What do you mean, wouldn't know? Don't rile her up, Elise. She's calling me a witch. Anyone want to say anything about it? <laughs> nope. We'll take care of her. Oh, Don't worry, you, dearie. Listen, all you are to be treated with respect. <laughs> this one is accusing... Accuse me of... to be treated with respect, not... No, they don't get to be treated with respect. They get to be treated with respect. Oh. Mm. Yeah, exactly. If that's the case, then I can't wait to get <laughs> old and start just... Talking, like, just calling everyone off. But you can't say anything back, because I'm old, so treat me with respect. Mm. You probably get put in a mental hospital. That's the way it normally goes. Yeah, they start saying wacko things, and then they got shoved in a mental hospital. Yeah, that's what's about to happen to Miss Audley over here, too. There is no mental hospital there. I, I highly doubt that. <laughs> Well, there's a church. You know what happens to people in churches. You know, they get shot by holy water. What? You know, they get shot by holy water, exactly. I don't think they had water guns back then. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure they would drown you in holy water. Uh, mm -hmm. that, that's the sort of murder in the person. That's not murder. That's drowning them. That's attempted murder. It's, it's killing them. I mean... Or torture. Isn't, isn't when you're... Would get burned up. Isn't when you're baptized, don't you just sink your entire body in the water? And you have to be... I'm pretty sure when you're baptized, you don't drink the water. And you only go under for literally a second. Wait, wait, X Park, what are you talking about drinking water? Kind of you've been hearing oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've been hearing about you get dipped in the water. You don't, so, 
I'm like, trying to figure like, out. You can dip in the water like your head goes under the water, yeah. But, like, it's only underneath it for a second. Okay, sure okay, okay, we stuff. can get past that fully, X part. Soaked. We can get past that I part. Know, kind of here, but back. I need to understand, what is the drinking part coming into this? You said, oh, they're gonna drown her. And you said, oh, isn't that what happens at baptisms? The answer is no. Okay, I didn't say it like that, first off. You, you did. You should have made it more clear that you were talking about something different then, because that's exactly what it sounded like. No, I was making like, a statement like you had that they do put you system. under the water. No, now I have and to look uh, up. Yeah, yeah that is great. You know, that is great. No, I'm gonna have to look up how, how bath customs work. Let me, let me, let me show you. I'll see. You'll look this up on stream. Yes, yes, I will. Come. Everyone, I'll be looking up how bath customs work. The, thing, the funny thing is, I never disagreed with them being clever with the water. I I'm trying to figure out what is this drinking part alive. coming in. This drinking part, I don't understand what's going on with the drinking part. Mm -hmm. Well, okay, if you're getting drowned, then you're swimming with any food. Mm-hmm. I don't know what kind of drownings you've been to, but personally... That's a process of, okay, the priest blesses the bathtub as a water, that's the pants, there's not the sins, the baptism, child with water. I, I, know, I know how the baptism is. Also, usually baptisms happen when they're children, don't they? Uh, as far as I know, it's a choice for when the person wants to do it. But usually it's, it's at childhood. Normally, yeah, I guess, normally it is for like a child if they're like, born into like... Something mm, that's yeah. not so much a choice, is it? Um, but um, we're not gonna get past that part. <laughs> Represents you. Most kids do it because their parents say that they Yeah. I mean, it is a decision for them to listen to their parents. Okay. And... Okay. I feel like I'm spending this entire time looking at baptism. I'm learning a lot of new things, but... <laughs> Okay, give me a second stream. Well, if you're, if you're going to be looking up about baptisms, you might as well start becoming a just chatting streamer. Uh, yeah, hey guys, I'm just chatting. Mm -hmm. It's just, you know, you I'm just staying there. You didn't have looking up on the screen. Say so what? You didn't have what you looking up on the screen. I won't. It's on the screen. I'm looking it's on my phone. Just stream ever. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm gonna talk to these two while I'm doing this. Just play the game. I am. Um, I'm looking at Baptist. You can do it after the stream. Well, then I won't have the answers. If somebody now. is that interested about baptisms, then they can go ahead and look it up on their own time. Well, everyone, if you want to know about the baptisms, look it up, and then, yeah. But there is a lot of, there's a lot of steps to baptism, I will say that. There's a lot of stuff going on with their baptisms. At this point, I don't even know what I was talking about before, because all I remember is drinking. That's all I remember. I remember talking about the water gun, and then you talked about getting drowned. It's like in the baptism. I think so. I don't remember anymore at this point. <laughs> I've been sitting here looking. I know you don't. <laughs> I've been sitting here looking for too <laughs> long. My stream is always... Go look up baptisms if you want to. I don't, that's all I can say. That's yep. all I can say. Uh, you should, uh, weave... Weave? You should weave in more of those blue flowers, Linda. Didn't we leave the maple to Freya this year? Freya clearly has better taste, anyhow. Okay, Elise, I do... You know, I do... I don't like 
Oh my, or is it Bertha too? But let's not antagonize her. Whoa. I don't remember inviting you to this conversation, Lassie. This isn't Bertha, this is Wilma. Come now, Miss uh, Wilma. Freya's not even finished with it yet. I'd say she'd be sad if you changed it without telling her, Miss Wilma. Why, I, I never do such a thing. I trust her judgment. Sure you do, sure you do. Mm-hmm. I'm having her lend a hand with the wraiths, too. Wraiths? Wraiths. Not only with wraiths. Uh, so you can find even more faults in her work. I see. I haven't asked you for your hand. I haven't asked you for a hand for a reason. It's best if we keep calm. Oh, that was just like a little conversation we had. Well, good to let you know she's a mean person. I promise you, every time I have like a talk with Wilma, Bertha, or what's the other one? I forget, but it's yeah. never it's never good. This is ties this is tiring, Rosemary. Asking about town, you mean? No, I don't think we can count on that. I should have chosen my words a little more carefully, I suppose. That's alright, Elise. We'll find a way. It's a little too late for that, Rosemary. If only I could turn back time and attempt it again. Attempt what? Oh, but the key? That, I guess we're talking about that, but you know. Either way, folks are rather ruthless. Haven't you been asking about town yourself, have you? Oh, no, of course not. All right, well, I'll call it, call you for you. I'll call for you if I need you. I'll be here, Elise. Well, yeah. Okay, I think I've talked to a good few people. And how long has the stream been going on? Because we're talking about bathisms. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like an hour. Like an hour. I think, maybe. Yeah, maybe it's, it's like an hour. An hour or 15. It's an hour, yeah. Um, I think this will be a shorter stream. You start play for more, but it's later at night. x also has his own stream to get to. Yeah, I'm gonna do that for a little bit. So I'll just be there watching him, maybe, probably. Um, <laughs> I'm doing other <laughs> things. Um, but I think that is where I'll end the stream off. Next stream, we'll actually get through this more, and the stream will probably be more early. Oh, excuse me, early in the morning. I'm actually not even stream this tomorrow because I really want to finish it also. I don't want to be... Um, <laughs> I know the reason why I finish it. need to explain. Yeah, because I want to actually be able to remember everything because um, if I don't, then I really won't remember who I talked to, what I did, and I'm going to be clueless about what happened. So i got to keep it fresh in the mind or I just really won't know what's happening. But that is where we'll be ending this stream. So hopefully you had a long time because I have a time thing in place doing this. Hope a long time everybody. And goodbye everybody.